For most people, driving a car at the famed Daytona International Speedway would be the ride of their life. But this is something you need to see to believe, and that's just it. Okay, I'll take it. The driver behind the wheel of this car is an amateur, and he's blind. We continue to take on greater risk and responsibility. And we couldn't think of anything that was riskier and involved more responsibility than driving. The National Federation of the Blind has partnered with Virginia Tech and Torque Technologies to develop innovative non-visual interfaces for cars. The interfaces transmit information about the driving environment and communicate that to the blind driver through a pair of vibrating gloves and the seat allowing him to independently operate the vehicle. To prove that the ability of the driver was essential to operating the car, the course was made even more challenging. Mark Riccobono didn't just navigate the turns of the racetrack, he was given other obstacles, including a slalom and drop boxes to further test his skills. The NFB Blind Drivers Challenge has created what others deemed impossible, a blind man driving, speeding past society's expectations of the blind. Most of the people I talked to didn't believe we could do it. Now, although many of us are amazed, we believe, and that means that vastly more effort is going to go into changing possibilities for us in the future. Yep. Yeah. Yeah.